Hi guys, Coach Drive and Josh, hope everyone is well. Day 4 of 4 is finally here. Uh, nice sunny day as well, which is quite nice. Uh, I've just got people walking around the coach. Not yet until 18.40, we're a little bit early. We'd like to come in, get a cup of tea and stuff from the transport hub. And then obviously I'll start loading when it's nearly time. Um, Oton Bus Rally is definitely going ahead at the moment. Um, obviously, subject to change, but we have got guarantee uh, that I am taking up a branded National Express coach. Um, what one? I won't know until the day. Um, destination blinds. Uh, our controller Ryan has sorted. Um, so that's, that has been sorted. Um, so the coach I'm on today, we've put a test. We put, the, put them up just to check them, to test them. They work. And they do work. Um, so on the day, the coach will have it. So the coach will have, for pickup use, um, we've got the Oton Bus Rally Private Hire Destination. And then I've got um, Coach Driver Josh one for when I'm at the bus rally for obviously to showcase who I am as well. Um, and then we've got all our normal ones like the 040, the 400, the 200s, the 444s, 460s. So there are going to be a variety of destinations you guys can flick through and have a look at, at for with the national destinations so they are on there as well right i'm gonna get going because it is gonna be a few minutes until i've got to uh, start loading but i thought i'd pop on and say hi and i look forward to seeing you uh, many of you hopefully at Oton bus rally or not many of you uh, coming on the actual uh, phrase at i look forward to seeing many of you at Oton bus rally um and i look forward to seeing many of you hopefully coming up on our shuttle service that i'm going to be running from the transport hub so remember transport hub channel town center siren sister pick up stop off at the m4 for about 25 30 minutes and then it's a short trundle to the uh, rally site we should be there hopefully for about 9 30 10 o'clock the event opens at 10 and then i'm not leaving until uh, after the event closes just after five so for people who don't want to come back on the shuttle service uh, that's fine you'll need to let me know um but it's going to probably be about 5 30 departure off from the show ground because uh, we'll let everything get out of the way and then we'll head back and then it just be a straight run back then to uh, Cheltenham and Gloucester and Siren Sester. Um, so at this moment in time, I can't give times uh, what time we will arrive back, but it's going to be about a 5.30 departure from the showground and then uh, probably about 7 o'clock-ish into Siren Sester, 7.30 into Cheltenham and probably 8 o'clock into, Chow uh, into Gloucester. But at the moment, that's all subject to change. Right, guys, I'll get going and I'll catch you a little bit later. Hi guys, coach driver Josh. Uh, you'll notice I'm at Central Bus Station, but something's a bit unusual. The side of the coach is not in service. Um, we have unfortunately broken down at Heathrow, so I'm just currently waiting for our engineering team to come out and uh, fix us. So, uh, yeah. Um, bizarre, I've never been in this situation. Uh, that's why I'm kind of doing this video clip to it, because I've never really been in a situation where uh, we've had a vehicle, oh, I've had a coach break down this far away from home. Because when obviously I work for stagecoach and stuff, a bus breaks down, within 10 minutes you've got a bus. Where we're in the middle of Heathrow, we're two and a half hours from Gloucester. Uh, so something like this breaks down, then it's a bit of a long wait. So I've been and got myself a coffee. Uh, I'm going to take a walk around and try and keep myself uh, occupied for a little bit because it's a little bit quiet here tonight. Um, I say a little bit, it's very quiet actually, all the bays are empty, I'm literally, and there's me and there's an Oxford coach next door loaded, so that's like the only two that are in, so yeah, I'm going to go and have a walk round and uh, go and have a look round while I'm waiting for the engineering to come, because I've got nothing else I can do, um, I've cleaned the coach, so, uh, and the taco's on rest, so it's just going to, uh, it's going to be a long one, so I will keep you guys, uh, keep you guys posted, and uh, hopefully I'll see you when I clock off uh, tomorrow morning. Hi guys, Coach Driver Josh. We're still waiting. Uh, they're on our way, on their way. Our fantastic engineering team from Gloucester, the guys that keep the wheels moving. That he's on his way up. Uh, so we broke down at nine thirty. It's now just gone eleven thirty. So been about three hours. Um, so he's going to turn up, and hopefully we're going to get the uh, vehicle fixed and get back out on the road. Um, my passengers. I should have been at Victoria. Um, should have been getting on Victoria. They're being bought as a Scania Levante Mark III triaxle 025 to London, where I should have been going. 
but uh, obviously didn't. So yeah, he's on his way down. Uh, hopefully they're going to get us going and hopefully we can get, get it back to Gloucester. So what they're planning on doing is they're planning on bringing uh, my passengers from Victoria down to Heathrow in two big coachfuls. Um, and hopefully, um, yeah. yeah. There goes the 025. But yeah, hopefully uh, within the next uh, half hour or so, we should have hopefully be... Uh, hopefully get moving so of course i will keep you guys updated and uh if if you don't see another video from central bus station it's good news and i will see you guys when i eventually clock off tomorrow morning uh but of course i will keep you guys posted see you in a bit hi right, guys it's coach Trevor joshua again it's 12 17 uh the coach is turned on seat reservations are out ready and we will be leaving heathrow to head back to gloucester so uh yeah Time to just stretch my legs and then uh, once the two coaches turn up, I'll get my passengers loaded and we'll get back to Gloucester. So uh, I'll see you guys when the clock off. Morning, guys. Coach Driver Josh here. We've clocked off. It's just gone five o'clock in the morning. Um, it's daylight. Uh, daylight is like... It's, it's like I'm a vampire to daylight being obviously duty tan. Um, not for much longer, that's going to change. I'm going to be dropping on to duty nine from uh, near enough the end of the month. Um, so it's still going to be a bit of a half one, half two finish, but uh, not as uh, late as I have been finishing. So, uh, yeah, interesting shift. Massive shout out to our on-call engineer, Charlie, who um, come out to CBS and he got me uh, impressively quick. Uh, we got the problem kind of sorted at Heathrow, which allowed me to um, pick my passengers up to uh, bring them back to Gloucester. Massive shout out to National Express themselves in the control centre in Birmingham for being amazing and um, just generally helping get the passengers to me at Heathrow because um, obviously I didn't make it to Victoria, unfortunately. Um, so um, massive shout out to them. Massive shout out to the 040 and the 025, I think it was, that they come in on. Um, I might have got that wrong, so apologies if I did. Massive thanks to the drivers uh, for managing to get my passengers onto your coaches. Uh, so that saved a bit of a headache. Otherwise, it would have been a case of fix the coach, drive it to Victoria, load and just go straight out because I managed to get a... Nice two-hour break on my taco while I was sat at Central Bus Station, obviously waiting for uh, Charlie, our engineer, to come out. Just checking I put my taco up there. So, yeah, right, I'm off. That's two days off now, and then I'm in for the four days, off on the Saturday, and then it's Oton Bus Rally on the Sunday. I cannot wait. That's going to be so fun. Um, again, it's subject, obviously, if we're going to have a coach on the day, um, and then if if we are if it's going to be either a Volvo or a Scania it's definitely a National Express branded coach that's all I know um, but until the day I won't actually know what coach we've got and again obviously it's all subject to change um, it could be cancelled at the last minute unfortunately uh, because obviously we need the coaches for the national network and I don't want to be taking a coach off of national for the day when it could be used out on the network um, we have got a replacement coach in place so to allow me to take a national coach. Um, but obviously things change. Coaches break down like they did with um, JYL last night at CBS. Um, so, yeah, coaches um, coaches do do break down. And, uh, yeah, JYP, sorry, and JYL. Um, coaches do break down. Um, and, uh, yeah, things do go wrong. Right, I'm going to get going because I am absolutely exhausted. It's been a really, really long shift. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to have my two days off. So whatever you're doing, stay safe, and I'll catch you when I return to work uh, back on Tuesday for a, I think it's it'd be an 1810 departure to London. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys on Tuesday. Have a fantastic day. Stay safe and uh, catch you later.